In today's video, we talk metabolic training, exactly what it is and how it's going to help you build lean muscle tissue and incinerate body fat. Guys, I'm Frank Daniels, and before we get going, make sure you download my free core training report where I give my nine best tips on how to build a rock solid midsection. Download that by clicking this link right here. Now let's talk metabolic training. And the big issue with most people when it comes to working out is time. Now, metabolic training is going to be perfect for you people in a time crunch because now we can combine some fantastic elements of fitness that are going to help you get a rock solid body and of course combine all these little elements that you need in your training. So basically metabolic training is where we take um, resistance training which is very important for rock solidness, right? That's what we want. Resistance training and in an interval fashion or the pace or the timing of the workout is going to kind of pull in this cardio aerobics. So I can get resistance training, I can mix in some power, the pace of the workout is the cardio aerobics, and now I don't have to take so much time to do so many different things, I can get it all in one short bout of intense muscle madness. And that's what it's all about. So really you don't have to do your cardio over here, and then you go hit the weight section over there, and then there's a Pilates class going on over there that you have to add in, and yoga, and hot yoga, and hot Zumba and bar method where you're tilting your, your pelvis like you can't really see it, it's off the camera but I'm, I'm really getting some good bar method ac action. Okay, no, in a time crunch you use metabolic training. Once again, that combination of strength and cardio together because of the pace. Now there's a couple different ways that you can do this. Either you take a circuit of exercises so somewhere between, could be anywhere from two to five exercises to be quite honest, um, and you set a work and a rest period. So you work for a certain amount of time and you rest for a certain amount of time until you go through that cycle of exercises. And then you repeat somewhere between, depending on the intensity of the workout, could be a 10 minute workout, could be a 25 minute workout. Once you start going past that, it's probably too long to be considered metabolic conditioning or metabolic training. What you can also do is, once again, take a circuit of exercises. Could be anywhere from two to five exercises. Could be more, okay? But I'm just giving you guys some parameters to work with. But uh, you take those exercises and you just do them in succession with no rest and you race against the clock. So say you set a clock for 15 minutes. You do as many rounds as you can in 15 minutes. We call this density training. Um, it could be 10 minutes, could be 12 minutes, could be 20 minutes. Um, but you want to set the parameters for yourself and work against it so that, once again, you're combining strength elements, power elements, cardio elements, all into one, creating a metabolic mayhem that ultimately incinerates body fat and puts a muscle on your frame. Now, the thing you need to look out for in metabolic training is a huge pet peeve for me, and that is fatigue. And as a matter of fact, the word pet peeve in itself is a pet peeve for me. I can't stay, I don't know what it is, it just irks me. Uh, but anyway, fatigue in itself can happen when you're doing metabolic resistance training, when the intensity of the resistance and the combination of the cardio and all that stuff is mashed together, people can break their form, which would be a direct indication that either you're not in good enough shape to be able to continue at that intensity for that long, or you just need to stop and go back, look at your technique, look at your form, make sure that it is flawless, that's what we expect, and be able to maintain that throughout the duration of whatever your parameters of your workout are. And that's what it's all about. So I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you download my free core training report where I give you my nine best tips on how to get a rock solid midsection Click this link right here. And of course, if you really like this video, head down below, like, leave a comment, tell me what you want to see, and subscribe to this channel. My name is Frank Daniels. Enjoy your metabolic resistance training. Support. My nine best tips on how to... They're good tips, I swear. Pet peeve in itself is a pet peeve for me, just as an FYI. Or, that was poor planning. I didn't really have a second thing. A lot of pelvic tilting and grinding and or um, you just I keep messing up with this or there's not a lot of there's no or I got to figure out what it is Fuck. okay uh, 